I'm Sister Agnes Weinsapel, and I have been a member of this community for over 50 years. How I was attracted to this community, well, my family, I had two uncles who were priests. I had an aunt who was a sister at Beach Grove. She entered here at Ferdinand, but then when they transferred, or when we started the Beach Grove community, she be was transferred up there. So religious life was always a possibility. As I was growing up, when I was younger, oh yes, I wanted to be a sister. But you know, my later years, nope, that's out of the question. I won't do that. When I was in high school, I was still, I'm not gonna do it. My senior year, something changed. I had a teacher, Sister Mary Charles at that time, later known as Sister Carla, and she approached me. I said, no, can't do it. It's not for me. Well, she said, think about it. I think that was the seed that was sown. A few months later, my mom asked me the question because I didn't want to do anything. I didn't want a job. I didn't want to work outside. I wasn't interested in marriage. I just didn't know what I wanted to do. So when mom asked the question, I said, okay, mom, maybe I need to think about this. And from there on, it developed. At, towards the end of the, my senior year, the superintendent at Modern Day was Father, oh dear, what was his name? Father Daywig. And he uh, offered to bring those of us who thought we might be interested to Ferdinand. So there were six of us. Well, I got the measles that day. So I, oh good, I don't have to go. That's my answer. <laughs> but it kept bugging me, it literally bugging me. And I did finally say, okay, I would try it. Then it was May and Sister Julia, who was the superior at that time, came to Modern Day and I was called out of my class to go to the principal's office. And uh, she, I walked in and she was there, I was introduced to her. And uh, she said, I hear you're interested. And I said, well, I'm thinking about it. She said, well, here's your medal, which is a symbol that you are going to enter. And I'm here today.